today you're going to learn how to make a grid in Flipgrid. So for the first thing that you're going to do is go to flipgrid.com. If you haven't signed up, you'll sign up first and put all of your information. Use your WCPS 5 and 3 and your password. When you sign in any other time, you'll click log in and you'll log in with your Google sign in. I've logged in today, so I'm just going to click log in. The first thing that you're going to do is go add new grid. You're going to name your grid. And then I would like you to click school email. You're going to choose school email every time. Make sure it's highlighted. They'll give you a code here and then you'll click next. They're going to ask you to add a school email. I've added this in my other demonstrations. This is a school email that you're going to add. You're going to put at wcps.k12.md.us. The next thing I'm going to do is click next. And then this is the code that I would copy. I would copy this code. I could also put it in my Google Classroom assignments directly. Um, it's up to you which way you would like to do this. Uh, you could always copy it and put it in a topic called Flipgrid Grid for our class and be able to do that. Once you go to your grid, you'll see you'll have the title up here called Digital Citizenship and the date that it was done. You'll be able to see the Flipgrid code and if you click on this, you'll be able to view it as a student and you'll get to see how a student would see the first part. It is your choice whether or not you want to keep this say hello on Flipgrid. If you want to delete it, you could always go here and go to the very bottom and hit delete topic. They'll make sure and ask you if you are sure of doing that. Or you can go to the pencil here and you can actually edit it and change times and different things as well.